Hello, what's up guys? Rhino Crunch here today and we are doing some King of the Hill in one of my favorite cities, the City of Electro. We have about 15 members of the Crunch Army waiting to extract into Electro. Today's King of the Hill event is gonna be on top of the office slash school. Same rules apply, no oh, firearms, people are going to use melee weapons only. They have two minutes to stay at the top of the tower in the salute position. The winner today is going to get a medal on the forums called Ain't No Punk Target Punk, which two. signifies their win. They will also win whatever copy of a game they want via Steam and the bragging rights for winning King of the Hill and Electro. Participants will win a uh, ribbon and the glory of participating. Uh, for those of you who are new to these events, they're all open to the public via rhinocrunch.com. You guys are all welcome to sign up. I also post announcements on Twitter and Facebook, so you guys are welcome to follow me there, twitter.com slash rhinocrunch, facebook.com slash rhinocrunch, to get in on this event, okay? I'm excited for this. Is everybody in the helicopter excited? Post in the text chat how you feel. Are you guys ready to get it on? Are you guys nervous? They're all nervous. Okay, guys, let's get it on. And here we go. Oh man, this is gonna be good. And it looks like, oh, what a perfect extraction. The winner today and epic, epic, epic extraction. We got some people going slow. Whoa, whoa, whoa! This guy just went straight down, and he didn't—he didn't die. It looks like some people. Oh, they missed their landing, and that's going to be a part of the game today. His best bet is jumping off on top of another player. Oh, there's two people up there. They don't realize they don't see each other. PVP is open anywhere. And and, and uh, uh, looks like. We got a contest hitting up, up, up the top. User in your channel timed out. User Some major, your major lag here. We got three people up top going going at it. Four people up top going at it. People running off the top. Desync happening everywhere. I think the the zombies the a major factor in this. People are just all over the place with this. Zombies attacking players. Players attacking players. We got two people up top. Legs are broken. Three people with broken legs swinging at each other at top. Fourth person bleeding. Fifth person looks like the two guys have, they're not paying attention to themselves. We got a sixth person coming in. Six people up top. Evil killed. Bandito killed. Fat boy killed. Boone killed. Another person looks like he got knocked off. And he did. He, he didn't die. He broke his legs. We got two people on top of the tower. Neither one in the slew position. One bandaging. And this is just this is this is just chaos. So many people. We got people in the office building uncontested. We got dead people out front. Looks like we have someone's turning into a bandit. Oh, he wasn't dead. He was just knocked out. And then Boone is dead. People going at it all over the tower. Nobody nobody going in the slew position yet. Two people going at it. One of them's down other guy the other guy is up and he was able to finish him without bleeding he's not in a slew position at the top of the tower though oh there's two people he's not knocked out he, he he's knocked out he's not actually dead oh somebody got somebody got knocked out on the second story of the tower contestants who respawn in electro are welcome to come back and try again and we got people climbing up the ladder. We have people all over the tower still. Finally in the slew position. Who is in the slew position? Looks like we have Kieran in the slew position being contested. Clock has started. 
and we got a contestant who is actually going to be challenging him. And people all on top of that thing are, are, are actually just respawning, it seems like. Apocalyptic down, Bandito down, Terry jumps off the top, and he was killed. Somebody fell through the bottom there, and people are just knocked out. Boone getting killed again. It seems like the server's glitching out, guys. We got people on the second story still going at it. Boone, are you respawning in on this? I think it's a server lag. Terry Dennis down. Bandito killed again. And in the slew position, who's that on the top floor? Please talk in global who's on the top floor. Kieran again. Okay, so we're going to restart the clock. 17 seconds. Kieran, the only one up, it seems like, on that top tower, is going to run the clock out. We have players all over. Uncontested. Ooh, somebody just dodged an axe down on the second tier there. We got players in the office building moving around. The rain is starting. Someone, Kelly, was killed. She crawled her last death out the side there. And Kieran, unaware, completely unaware, being attacked from the back. Captain Endo was killed. By Kieran, it looks like, and Kieran was killed. Looks like the, the whoever came up, the contester has no one to fight since they killed each other. Players all over that second. Looks like he's having a seat, not in the slew position. Maybe nervously trying to panic, panically find that slew position. Goes in the slew position. Jeremy's at the top in the slew position. Also unaware, getting struck twice by a contester bleeding going head to head blow for blow and he falls off breaks his legs good game jeremy jeremy got knocked out launched off the top of that tower zombies coming over to finish him three people up top one person goes down gets knocked out breaks their legs second person breaks their legs third person coming around finishing them both off mcnair was killed and, the sec and they're still going blow for blow. Pile of bodies at the top is extremely large. Crypto Deuce was killed as well. Final contestant on the tower, it seems, as he is the last one alive. Who is the player at the top of the tower? Post and Global, who's at the top of the tower, please? Buddha is at the top of the tower. And it looks like he's uncontested. No more players available. We're going to run down the clock on this. There's a lot of lag this game. Zombies were definitely a major part of it. It's 31 seconds in. Anybody who spawns in Electro is welcome to come back and try. You have a minute and 20 seconds to get here. And that was a good game. Zombies were definitely a part of it once again. And uh, there was a lot of... A lot of a lot of stuff going on. There's people fighting inside, people fighting out front, all over the top of the t tower. It was definitely an epic game. And I think the clock's going to run down here. Somebody spawned in next to him. Bleeding. Oh, I think he turned to a bandit. There might be players that are knocked out up there. Jeremy was killed. No, yeah, the player... A player spawned in next to him. And they're going head to head, blow for blow. Clock has stopped. Blow for blow, they're going at it machete for machete. The guy is bleeding. And he is knocked out, his legs are broken. And he's going to get killed, it looks like. 
Buddha very cautiously getting the kill, knowing the guy's broken, keeping his space from him. You are allowed to re-enter Electro for this if you guys make it here. Blow for blow, Jeremy was killed. And Evil Red Killer was killed as well. They might be respawning, going back in the salute position. Approximately one minute to go here. And knocked out players are waking up all over the battlefield here. Forty-five seconds till he claims the win. Going to do a twenty-second countdown. He's got a contester. Clock is stopping at forty-seven seconds. Going back down the ladder. Back in the sloop position, Buddha with 20 seconds, 20 second countdown incoming. Looks like the guy's bandaging at the bottom. Buddha holding his position 20, 19, 18, 17, 16. Clock stopped at 16 seconds. Going blow for blow. Got a third contester coming up. Blow for blow, they are missing. We got a third contester coming up. Looks like we might have a fourth contester. Apocalyptic was knocked out and killed. Blow for blow, Buddha and a, a contester. Looks like someone broke their legs. Jeremy was killed. Looks like they both broke their legs. Buddha was killed. Somebody at the top of the tower. Buddha, oh no, with 15 seconds to go, loses his life on the top of there. Who is the person at the top of the tower? Please say in chat. Endo, is that Endo at the top of the tower? Endo at the top of the tower, still not in the slew position. Plenty of time. It's Kira. Kieran, again at the top of the tower, still not in the slew position, though. Tons of time for people to make it back to Electro on a respawn. And salute position is starting. So this has been an interesting game. We're experiencing some server lag with the zombies. And some people are... And Kieran just got knocked out. Knocked out low on blood. Kieran can't hold this loot position without taking a knockout. Oh my god. Kieran unable oh Kieran unable to get up with such low blood. Piles of bodies everywhere on top of there. Contester coming up, looking for Kieran's body, swinging at everybody, unable to find Kieran. Fat boy was killed. Contester swinging his axe, swinging his machete. I, su I should say. Kieran trying to defend himself. Buddha was killed again. Kieran finally killed. Contester at the top of the tower is. Endo's at the top of the tower. The clock has started. Endo 10 seconds in. Uncontested. Plenty of time for people to make it back here. And... Looks like we got players next to me that don't want to participate. <laughs> 40 seconds in nobody's contesting zombies might be contesting looks like they're coming up another epic game here at king of the hill electro is one of my favorite cities in chernogorsk and the body count up there is ridiculous looks like a waterfall of blood just coming through on the office there unbelievable amount of blood coming through and this was definitely one of the most bloodiest games we've seen. We've got a minute and ten in for Endo. And a contester makes his way into the office building. 
And I think we're going to have one more contester on this. Looks like he's got, he's got a priest chase, chasing him. Endo, a minute 25 in. Going to be contested here. And clock stops at 131. They are going blow for blow here. Endo, a little bit nervous, spamming, spamming his melee button, just trying to catch the guy. Looks like he, he did catch him, he breaks his legs. Coming back around, looks like the guy's rolling off the top of the tower. Doesn't want anything to do with it. Rolls off, dies. Endo was killed, who is that on top of the tower? Crypto do on top of the tower. Clock has now started. Plenty of time for contestants to make their way back. This is going to be an interesting game. If people keep making their way back, this might actually pan out to be one of the longest games we have. Got 14 seconds in on this. Not being contested by anyone. Bodies and zombies are everywhere. <laughs> oh my gosh. Dennis was killed. Looks like people are trying to make their way back to this Electro office building. Looks like we have a contester making his way down. 49 seconds in. like there's going to be a problem with all these zombies here. We got a minute in, uncontested. Bring it on. Lots of zombies crawling all over the firehouse or all over the uh, all over the office building there. Contesters making their way back into the city for round 2. Are they going to make it in time? Crypto Deuce has 1 minute and 26 seconds in. No contesters in sight. Crypto Deuce might actually take this game. And it looks like we have... Oh, I stand corrected. We have two contesters making their way up. Clock is going to stop at 1 minute and 43 seconds. Crypto Deuce has 17 seconds if he can get yeah, past I'm his kill. Blow, blow for here. blow, swing for swing. And it looks like we have a, a third contester coming up, cockily taunting him, whoever's getting hit up there. Although he did get clipped with the machete blade. Looks like he is bleeding blow for blow, cornering him. And they gang up, pack mentality, take out the guy who's crippled. Crypto do going blow for blow once again with another player. Missing. Blow for blow there, missing. Looks like they both connected on that one. Crypto do is bleeding as well as the other one. Fat boy was killed. Crypto do swing for swing gets knocked out. Challenger immediately bandages himself. Fat boy was killed. We have players all over contesters all over hey, the Jimmy. place here. Looks like he's bandaging himself before he goes in the salute like position. Plenty of time for people to get back here. Bandit the bandito once again sitting down. Stands back up in the salute position, and we start again. This is this is an incredible game. Uh, Electro is home to about six of the spawns in DayZ, so it really gives players a chance to come back into this thing and try a second round. So dying right away uh, doesn't really mean much. We got Bandito on top. Who's at the top of the tower? It wasn't Bandito. Three people on top of the tower. One of them not noticing. Getting hit from behind. Legs broken. Knocked out. Dead. Crypto Deuce was, Deuce was killed. And so was Jeremy. The person at the top of the tower is apocalyptic. Goes into the salute position and the clock starts. We have somebody extracting in. Two people extracting in. Someone's doing pickups and dropping these guys off. Eight seconds in. This is a long game, folks. This is this is the champion round of Daisy King of the Hill. This is definitely uh, tournament style. 
Looks like we have a contester coming up the ladder. We got a bandit. Although he doesn't have... Oh, yes, he does have a machete. Clock stops at 27 seconds. Blow for blow. Bandit's getting hit by Apocalyptic. They're going blow for blow face to face. Neither one are connecting, even though they're standing right in front of each other. Looks like they're both actually bleeding. Apocalyptic was killed. An evil red killer was killed. I think they were lagging there. And the clock has stopped with nobody at the top of it. And we have more contestants coming to the top of the tower. This is going to be a sudden death round. First person to stay up there for one minute now is going to become the winner. The person at the top of the tower right now, please say your name. Please say your name at the top of the tower. You don't get a redo of your time. Kieran, once again, 10 seconds in, clock stops. Going blow for blow, all the player needs is a minute at the top of the tower. It refreshes after your death. Kieran and a contester going for it. Swing for swing, tit for tat, blow for blow. Somebody got knocked out. Can't tell who that is there. So many bodies, so much blood, so much mayhem. We have another contester. Bat boy, who's at the top of the tower right now? Please talk in side chat if you're at the top of the tower. Kieran's still at the top of the tower, 13 seconds in. Restarting the clock at 13 seconds. All he needs is 47 more seconds to make it up there, and he's going to win this King of the Hill in the sudden death round. Knocked out player wakes up and is coming back for some more. Blow for blow, they're missing, panicking. Trying to connect, but they can't seem to connect on each other. Oh, and it looks like somebody broke their legs. Does a barrel roll, does another barrel roll. It's going to barrel roll off the top of that. Blow for blow, he gets hit from behind, doesn't see it coming. Turns into a bandit at the worst possible time. Gets set off into the woods somewhere. I think uh, they got sent to the uh, they got sent to the debug forest. Fat boy at the top of the tower with the clock starting. 60 seconds is all Fat boy needs. He unsalutes. Clock starts again. Back at four seconds. And all he needs is 50 more seconds to take this game. And he is being contested. He's being contested, Fat Boy, trying to retain this win. This is definitely an endurance game here in Electro. Kieran was killed, fell off the tower, it looks like. And they're going blow for blow. They are missing, though. And it looks like someone broke their legs. And he's going in on the kill there. He's unable to connect. He's now bandaging up. He's knocked out. So the player who's at its ultimate was knocked out. The player that's at the top of the tower. Please say who you are in chat. Fat Boy. This clock is going to continue at 17 seconds. Fat Boy only needs... Well, clock's going to stop. Going to recontinue at 20 seconds. He needs his 30 seconds to win this sudden death round. And he's being contested with his broken legs. Evil Red. Kill. Kill. Bat Boy killed. Contesters all over the place. And it looks like someone turned into a bandit once again at the worst possible time. Buddha gets sent to the coast, unfortunately, with the glitch with the bandits. The person who's at the top of the tower, please say who you are. The clock's going to start at zero seconds.
Who's at the top of the tower? Please say who you are. Apocalyptic's at the top of the tower. Eight seconds in. We got a tester coming up the ladder. Looks like we are experiencing some server lag with the zombies and the respawn raids on this. Blow for blow, we catch up, seeing these two going at it. Clock has stopped at 20 seconds. Someone's bleeding. Back to back swinging, and it's this is incredible. We have so many players making their way back here because the amount of spawns in Electro. Knock Somebody got knocked out. Somebody got uh, killed up there. We're going to find out here in a minute who it is. Meanwhile, Ladder swings on him, swings on him again, still bleeding. Luckily cancels his bandage animation. Going blow for blow, still bleeding. Jeremy was killed. Looks like the player at the top turned into a bandit. And he bandages once again at the worst possible time as another player comes up, knocks him out. Apocalyptic was killed. And we have a new contester at the top of the tower in the slew position. And the player at the top of the tower is who? Crypto Deuce back again for some more. Third round, I believe. Eight seconds in. Crypto needs 50 seconds. 45 seconds. And he's going to win this King of the Hill. I don't see any contesters in the area. He is uncontested. Goes out of the salute position. Fat Boy was killed. And he's going blow for blow with another player. Looks like someone was knocked out. Captain Endo was simply knocked out. He wasn't killed. Back in the salute position at 22 seconds. Crypto needs 35 seconds to win this. We're going to do a 10 count. As soon as someone hits the ladder, the, the count will stop. And we see bodies dropping down below. Jeremy was killed. Terry was killed. Endo was killed. we got 20 seconds to go. And Crypto is going to win this. This has been the longest, most enduring uh, King we've seen so far. In Electro. Bro. This is definitely one of the longest. 10 second count. 10, 9, 8, 7. I'm just going to light them up a couple times here. I think I am lagging really bad. User in your channel. Because your channel. I could not kill him after shooting. And the lag was incredible in here. And there is no more to contest the tower. Crypto takes the win today, whatever game he wants on Steam. If you like this video, like it. If you don't, dislike it. Post in the comments the next location you'd like to see this done. If you'd like to participate in this epic Daisy King of the Hill, make sure that you like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter, and go to rhinocrunch.com to sign up on the forums to sign up for the server event. I know they're going crazy in the comments right now. I actually did kill Crypto. That's why he died. He did win the game. And the participants, like I said, will or the winner will, will receive a medal. Participants will receive ribbons. And for everybody else, as always, I love you all.